की से All right, we're gonna be. Oh, hello, you guys. Oh, so um, we're going to be re uh, we're we're gonna be reacting to King Von's mother, um, speaking on his passing. Uh, uh, it sucks, but. It sucks. I, I'm on stuck and you know it's sad that I I don't like react to stuff like this, but it's very, you know, interesting to look at, like as in like, you know, to know what's going on. It makes you want to change your life and better your life. So um just you know, it's very it's very not exciting, but it's like a um curious thing. You know what I'm saying? I'm curious to know what was going on out there because it's crazy how people lives are turning out when you make the wrong decision and things like that but um we're going to be reacting to king von's mother um before we get into that video if you guys do me a very big favor subscribe to my channel like with tisha 1000 like my videos on up share my videos y'all make sure your notification bell is on at all times so you don't miss any of my content and make sure you comment down below to let me know how you enjoyed it and if you know, what was your intake on everything like that? And what was your thoughts on everything? So, you know what I'm saying? Just let me know how you felt about it and stuff like that. So I can um, know in the comment section how, what was your thoughts on it? And everything such. So with that being said, y'all, we're going to get right into the video. Okay. Can an insurance company pay claims really, really fast? King Von Mother speaks on his passing. Sad reaction. Every mother knows how hard it is to lose a child, especially one that has children. Von's poor mom is stuck not knowing how to tell the little ones how their father passed. What she had to say about the whole situation was shocking. Would have never thought that she felt that way towards all of it. Welcome to Lime Report. Today, we'll be telling you everything you need to know about this situation, one detail at a time, so be sure to pay close attention. Before we get into this video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, comment keyword Vaughn for a chance at winning our giveaway. Now back to the video. Vaughn's mother seems to be stuck. She stated, it hasn't actually hit me yet. I'm in denial. So sad that she has to go through all of this. Vaughn and his mother had a very close relationship. And once the news started flying around, I guess you know what goes down once you hear something like that. The funny thing is, Vaughn's mom shared the beef Vaughn had with anybody trying to mess with him. He said, my mama a ride or die. Whoever I got beef with, she got beef with. I love it. Having a mom that invested in your career is something that's hard to let go of. And Vaughn, being the youngest boy out of three, is hard to let go. Vaughn's mom also had this to say about Vaughn. I wish I could have taken the bullet. He was too young. Whoever did this is going to pay for my baby boy. Looks like Vaughn's mom has one thing in common with Dirk, and that being getting the revenge they need. Since Rhonda's boy was behind all of this, I wouldn't doubt if she had added into the bounty. But what she said next might just give you chills. Vaughn's mom is taking great care of kids and said Vaughn's son is already rapping word for word in most of his songs. Maybe we can get another crazy story one day in the future. Being one of many to keep the legend's name on this earth, if Vaughn's son got into the rap industry when he was older, it could be something legendary. Not many kids follow their dads into the rap industry, but more into the gang side of everything. Hopefully, it's a different story for this little one. He has a big reputation to carry. With Dirk to teach him all his works, the future is bright. He has a good mentor ahead of him. Dirk is also taking part in the future of Vaughn's kids. Dirk promised Vaughn if anything happened, he'd be there to watch them and show them the roads of a true OG. The whole family has left their words on the whole situation from his sisters to his girlfriend and ex-baby mama. Many of them left speechless as the one kid who made them laugh and pretty much supported the whole family in a caregiver way just left their lives. 
But for the ones who shared to social media, it showed the world what he was capable of and how Vaughn was truly a good human just trying to have his family living a great lifestyle. Even in the videos of Vaughn, it was like you got to know him and see the man he was and not just the rapping gangster. Vaughn was the closest to his sister Kayla, he would have given her the whole world if he could. Recently, 21 Savage shared to his Instagram story a picture of him gifting Kayla a Range Rover. Everybody was confused as to why the rapper bought her a car, but later stated, I'm finishing what Vaughn started. If she's with my brother, I'm giving her the world. Knowing that many have their eyes on the family and keeping them safe at all costs is a relief. They have too much on their shoulder after dealing with what Lil Tim has done to them. One decision of his led to three lives gone. What was going through that kid's head? Sources once said Vaughn's mother found out it was Rondo's boy who did it. She said, I thought that boy was up to better. Bowling her eyes out and not being able to sleep with the trauma of her baby boy. Not ever going to walk through the door. We saw Vaughn as a gangster, but they didn't even view him as that. All they knew Davon Bennett, we knew King Vaughn the rapper from O Block. So once you lose someone who gave you the whole world every day, you're left to nothing. You have no light to shine upon you. That was Vaughn's role. He was the light that made their day complete. It's honestly crazy to think that there was a whole different side to Vaughn we never got to experience. I wonder what kind of Vaughn was behind the camera. Seemed like he had a happy vibe, as he always had a smile whenever he was around his closest friends, like with him and Dirk in interviews. Honestly, the rap industry is going to have a huge part missing from it. With Vaughn gone, he had so much to give to the table. The storytelling, by far the fans' favorite, Vaughn was hands down the best storyteller. It was like you were a part of them. The series Crazy Story will be seen as gold. We'll genuinely never see anything like it again. Only rappers like J. Cole and Kendrick Lamar have been known for their storytelling. Vaughn's mom should be proud she raised a legend. Without Vaughn, the whole world would be in a different place, especially the streets of Chicago. That's all we got for you guys today. Thanks for tuning in till the end. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and comment keyword Vaughn for a chance of winning our giveaway. See you next time on Lime Report. What y'all love fucking with the big bond at all? Look at gang, now looking like your mama. Hold on, let me get out of there, bro. Where your head so, man? Damn, look at Sky, looking like... He looks just like your mama. Damn, that's, 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 that's messed up. Damn, what you say that's messed up? Y'all all looking like... He's so dead, that's messed up. <laughs> I said, it's messed up. Say it's messed up. She's like, oh, mama. You finna go to the mall, Scott. Yeah. Okay, so with that being said, y'all, y'all seen where that went and everything like that. That's crazy how um, things is going on and everybody is getting hurt and everybody is going through what they're going through. It sucks. But at the end of the day, like, what can you do at that point? You know what I'm saying? Like, it's nothing that you can possibly do but go through that situation or Don't put up with it. It's, it's nothing that you can really do. It's, it's nothing that you can really, dang. It's like, it don't want to pause. Sorry about that. Like, it was technical difficulties right now. My computer did not want to shut up, but y'all excuse that part. But yeah, like I said, um, it sucks to have to go through something like that with your, with your child. It sucks to have to even put up with something like that with your child, even knowing that your son is like, like, all over the internet where his enemies can watch him anybody can watch him anybody can make memes about it and everything like that um they were saying that it was you know uh autopsy pictures that was out and stuff like that yes i did see him and i feel personally like that is very disrespectful i would never show nothing like that on internet or anything but i feel like that's very disrespectful so they need to get that taken down immediately whatever they got to do by the government whatever to get it taken down because that's very disrespectful for him and i know when he's looking down on that he's like yo really like it's crazy so um my condos go out to him i really love his music he's very talented he's very loyal to his family he takes care of his family no matter what he's a great uncle he's a great father like he's just a lovable person yes he done a lot of things and he do a lot of things but you know he was now he's deceased you know rest in peace to him but overall that man is a very good man he you know he did a lot of good you know what i'm saying he did the bad because of what he was the, the, you know the person you know how he was growing up and in the streets and everything because out there that's what it is but you know what i'm saying um, when you try to better yourself, whatever situation is, stuff tends to come up and you got to do certain things that you don't like and it can come out bad or not. 
But in his situation, he's gone, y'all. So, you know what I'm saying? My condolences go out to his family, like, strongly. My condolences go out to his sister, strongly. My condolences go out to his nephew, his kids, strongly. His, 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 his girlfriend, strongly. His baby mama, strongly. His mother, strongly. Like, my condolences go out to them because... I don't ever want to ever feel what that feel like, and I don't never, I ne I don't know, like you know what I'm saying. But it sucks, and you know he was very talented. He had a lot of goals that he had to reach, and he was almost up there. And every time when you try to get to the top, they always tend to knock you down in the wrong way, just like they did Pop Smoke. So, uh, with that being said, y'all, um, just stay prayed up, stay safe. You know what I'm saying. Stay out of trouble. I don't condone to that. I don't do none of that, but it's like, you know what I'm saying? I was very curious to know, like, what's going on with this rapper and everything like that. So, as you see, I'm following up and everything, but it's going to come to an end at some point because I'm not going to keep posting everything, but I will post some things. And like I said, um, with that being said, y'all, if y'all can do me a very big favor, subscribe to my channel, Life Will Teach You 1000, share my videos, like my videos on up, y'all, because I'm going to need it and it will help me. It will really help me. I will really appreciate it. And um, comment down below to let me know that you, you know, if you saw what I just watched, how did you respond to it and what was your response and if you liked it and if you enjoyed my reaction, hopefully you guys did because this is the way, the way that I know how to do it to the best of my ability. This is the way I know how to do it. So I'm not good with the screen sharing and everything like that. But this is the way your girl Life with Tisha do it. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. Obviously y'all do because I've been seeing a lot of subscribers support me. So thank you guys so, so much for that. Just keep it coming. Every time I see subscribe and I see likes and, vi and views on my, on my channel, it helps me. You know, want to keep doing it. It uplifts me. It pushes me to get up and go harder and harder. And I'm only going to get so much better. So y'all just hanging in with your girl and keep supporting me. And keep showing your girl some love. And I really appreciate you guys. So with that being said, just make sure y'all keep your notification bell on. So you don't miss any my content. Like it and subscribe. And comment down below, y'all. And I will see y'all on the next one.